Good morning everyone, today is a beautiful day. It's Monday, I have a ton of homework to get done so I'm currently going to the park right now. I really wanna get some good quality outside time. I have a class for school at 12 and it's only about nine o'clock and I'm hoping to work out before that because I have never been to an actual gym. I only go to like a gym at my personal trainer's house twice a week and she kind of does with me what she thinks I need to work on but I've learned a lot of knowledge about working out and positioning and just like your body and stuff that I think I would be able to work out on my own. The reason why I have a personal trainer is because when I first started working out last year, I just didn't think I had it in me to know how to use the weights or anything like that because I'm like super unathletic. That's like my thing. Um, but I thought it'd be, I thought, I think I'm ready to work out on my own and I also had to miss my workouts last week because I was really busy and so I'm in a need of a workout and I'll have to get food and then school. So it is a vibey day. I'm gonna put on some Taylor Swift and jam my heart out. I saw you from across the room. I remember one time, like last year, I was sharing my hotspot with someone and they said that my password was lame because it was just Annie's iPhone. And so I was like, fine, I'll change it to something interesting. And the first thing that came to my mind was Chick-fil-A BC. So that's what my password is, like ABC. I don't know why that was the first thing that came to my mind, but it's my password and I think about it every time I have to use my hotspot. It's so funny. Bruh, I left my freaking paper that I'm supposed to turn in today on my class and I left it at home. So I have to leave a little bit early. It's only five minutes earlier than I was planning on leaving. What the heck? Sometimes my break breaks make weird noises. But we're all Gucci. I got a lot done on my um, paper and the sun was like on me directly. So I'm really happy. Back home. <laughs> okay, where are you? Speed. What is it? Where is it? Where is it? Here we go. Okay, let's see. Print. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe I did that. Perfect. I'm gonna plan out my workout before I go in. That way I'm not like kind of waiting around. Um, so let's do step ups, 10 each. Um, battle rope if it's there. I love a good battle rope. What are these called? some groceries for my mom at Target and I did a really great workout it was so much fun I now am using deodorant because I didn't get time to shower I was gonna go home and shower but then my mom needed something so I was like oh okay oh so you know that thing where it's like you can't smell your own sweat that's literally a lie every single time that I sweat I can smell it and like I know maybe I'm hypersensitive because I have like a fear of sweating I can always smell myself so I don't know where people get that from Anyways, I'm now going into class. It starts at 12.15 and I got here, let's see, five minutes early, so I'm thriving. Class is over and I just got myself some Chick-fil-A. I'm waiting to leave Chick-fil-A and I've been here for like five minutes. This is like the busiest road ever. Good food, good workout, good school, good friends. Literally thriving. Leaving my house for the... 
leaving my house for the third time. Y'all wanted a day in the life, and here it is. So I got Chick-fil-A on my way home from school. I ate it, I came home, I napped, and now I'm going back out because I still have a ton of stuff I need to do on a current speech I'm working on that I'm really excited, but kind of stressed about. Um, and I have to drop something off for my sister at her house and um, probably have to get gas. Sunset is gonna be soon enough, and I was thinking about watching it. I'm already gonna watch the sunrise tomorrow morning, um, but I thought it'd be fun to watch the sunset tonight. We'll make it a little thing. Maybe I'll go to this coffee shop that's kind of far away. Whatever it takes to help me get this speech done because basically I am performing in a speech tournament with like professional judges and everything and it's a really big deal to not only me but my family because my whole family have done this tournament before and they did really well. So I'm nervous. It's like it's just a lot of pressure when you know your whole family is good at something like if I'm not good it will be really disappointing for me and for everybody. So I'm really focused on this speech. There's a guy standing in the turning lane. Ugh, he's gonna get run over. I want to tell y'all a little announcement. I started journaling recently. So basically, I used to keep journals when I was like super young um, and I read them back so freaking often. Like anytime I'm having a little life crisis, I just remember where I've been, what I've done, where I've come from. So I stopped for a really long time because holy moly, when you have so many things to talk about, your hand is just like, literally feels like possessed or something. It's like moving so quickly and it just hurt my hand. Like that's the sole reason why I stopped. It hurt my hand too much and I was like, I'm tired of this. And as I'm left-handed, like I would like write and then if I was using a pen, it was just like, get all messy it was awful but my sister gave me the advice and the um idea to start journaling on my computer which i never even thought about everyone journals in their notes at least i think so like most teenage girls that i do i know journal in their notes but there's something about notes that doesn't feel like real i guess like because i always have kind of scribbled down stuff in my notes so i started a page document on my laptop and i've done it for like three days now and i kid you not y'all it makes me feel so good um it just it literally like is like taking a bath it's like cleaning everything off of you everything you need to get off your chest and i definitely recommend doing it definitely do it on like a computer because it's way more accessible i'm really excited to have it to look back on and i'm hoping to journal a lot throughout this whole entire year there you go. You You're welcome. Saved my show. You're welcome. You. Bye. The things I do for my family. I'm just kidding. Everyone should work hard for their family. Period. So I want to go. I want to be outside, but I also wouldn't mind like being kind of alone. So I. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna just drive, and if I see something that catches my eye, I'll go. Okay, I found this like beautiful little area um, next to the lake. I've actually been here before, but like I've never really experienced it. I've just kind of walked through it, like to park and then go somewhere else. So I need to find somewhere to park because I don't remember where we usually park. But this place is like gorgeous. I feel like I could definitely find like an outdoor table and chairs and just work here if I can find parking. Oh my gosh, I found parking. Wait, I don't have to pay for this, do I? That'd be kind of ridiculous. Um, are you kidding me? I don't want to pay. I have a tall ice white mocha with oat milk and vanilla sweet cream cold foam. I took two wrong turns on my hair and like they were literally by like that much. And I had to like turn around, go out, and I'm just like, I'm so upset. I'm so upset. And I need to just calm down because it's not even a big deal. But it's just I have so much work to get done and I just really am dying to get it done now. I'll be fine. Okay, the sun is setting like way, way, way over there. I just need to get my work done. I'll see the sunrise tomorrow morning. That'll be in another vlog. Let's get this done. Also, I got a tall coffee. I never get tall. This is adorable. Ah, mm, so good. I got a ton of progress at Starbucks. I'm finally home. It's like 9.30 and I'm going to bed because I'm a grandma. I love you all so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Mm -hmm.